What's up, Sullivan King? We're here, Puka Festival in New Orleans, and we're hanging with Monster Energy today. At least Monster and Nola. Let's go. Playing a festival like Buku that has a more curated lineup outside of just dubstep and EDM and whatnot, it's definitely a little bit more of a challenge, but it's really cool to see the difference in the crowd as far as like who knows who you are and who really is coming in from like hip hop, pop, rock, all the different genres. Like you can kind of see where kids come in and they're almost unsure about like what the set's gonna be like. And then like when you do see the smiles on their faces by the end, like it's definitely a lot more rewarding than I think just going and kind of crushing a dubstep centric festival or stage. Like it's a lot more rewarding by the end, I think. Okay, well today's basically been 36 hours straight. Got to play a couple new songs tonight that I haven't played before, so that's always kind of like the highlight is like, let's see how they do, let's see how they sound and you know what the reaction is. So that was that was the best part for sure. And big all girls mosh pits. That was a highlight, we love seeing those, and the crowd starting its own circle pit. So good on you, Nola. You get to be in the top 10 for taking initiative. Trying to get a crowd to get excited over this music or over the performance, it really is just stage presence. Getting on the mic more and like whether it's a clap your hand or the drop is coming or find different ways to like have them open up a pit, headbang on the red, whatever it is, like it's kind of the standard for what people expect out of dubstep or out of a DJ set is like, oh, they're gonna get on the mic and tell you to do this stuff. But at the same time, like that is what kind of gets people excited that you're like trying to have that energy with them as compared to just playing songs and then walking off stage. Team Mosh Pit or Team Rail Rider? I'm Team Crowd Surfer, honestly, and you guys need to make that shit happen more because it's way too sick. I'm gonna go Mosh Pit. Mosh Pits are just like, it shows a little more initiative and a little more more aggression like it looks really cool when people had bang and i think it's dope and i like to but you know i think that there's a little more to be said about people that do that because if you're at the front of the rail and you're kind of just doing your thing and you're watching the show and you're just appreciating it you know that's cool too but mosh pit next up for me is a ton of music on the way a ton of festivals ton of weekend dates ton of clubs that we're doing ton of just little headline dates that are going to be super sick going back to canada going back to europe hopefully get some asia or australia in there be cool and a baby he'll be somewhere in there <laughs> Lola, two hours ago I found out my wife was going into labor and I just became a dad on stage. Gotta go be a dad, guys. I'm sorry.